hello and welcome back to my youtube channel it's Don here so today we are here because we are going to be making five cards using the plant lover collection so i've already done five cards using the um craft card stock we're now on to the mint card bases just having a drink i don't know if i'm able to show you it but look at that it's a shiny silver treasures and then it's the big bumblebee i didn't have any yellow so i need to buy well i've got some vinyl being delivered so then i will do yellow mm. but how cool is that that's so cool anyway i need to stay hydrated because it is very warm by the time this video goes out it's probably freezing because that's how yeah that's how our um planet works or how britain works anyway right um where to start well instantly i'm just gonna stick this down because i like it so why not oh, oh that, i managed to pick up a heart okay move you off there so let's stick this down like that because i just think it goes uh, quite nice and then we did um alphabet background on the last one so i'm going to do the same again because why not um i really like it and i love how it looks and it's a really good way of using up the alphabet stickers as well because yeah they can uh they can stay in our stash for a very long time don't get me wrong i love using alphabet stickers to make sentiments and stuff but there's always too many of certain letters that you know you're never going to use so this is like a really really good way of you know using that now on the last card i didn't put them down this bit but we are on this one okay Right, I'm gonna go. I'm trying to change up the letters just a little bit. Okay. Like this. There we go. Right. And then I'm just gonna fill this whole section up. So um I'm gonna do that, I think off camera just so that I don't bore you and then I'll be back right okay I'm back now I ended up just <laughs> I've done both sheets um I ended up just uh, doing a border and then I had a few left and I was I was getting carried away they are going to be covered those ones but we have got an alphabet border and I think it looks really cute so for I'm going to do these two together and what I'm going to do is basically what we did on the first card uh, in the last video, I think it was, where we tore around the whole edges. I've got a feeling I've got a delivery. Otarium. Yeah, I think my delivery is here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and sort out my delivery because he always rings the doorbell. Although, is it? I heard a car. I'm waiting on quite a large one. Right, okay, there's that. Um, sorry, I'm listening out for them. Right, I'm going to stick these two tags down. No, I don't think it is. Right, so I'm going to stick these two tags down on here. And on this one, I'm going to use the green tag. So I'm going to keep these two quite similar. I'm not going to put any twine through these ones i think what i might do is just do a twine ball at the top of them so there's that one i said i want the darker ones okay and then there's that one so that's the two tags together and then let's have a look to see what we've got now i really like this here and i think actually it does go on both so let's glue this down definitely for this one um i feel like that's just a cheat's way out but oh, it does go really well and i think sometimes if something goes really well just stick with it so we're going to stick with it um otherwise i'm going to be here forever right i've just found a little sticker 
of a plant pot so you can go there as an embellishment right I'm going to grab my twine and I'm actually going to make some balls so let's do that okay so there's one okay and I'm going to stick them where the twine should go so there's the first one so let's do our next one making sure to have these nice and neat okay and then so that card is now finished that looks really really nice so that's card number one yes lady um and then card number two so again let's make some balls so do you think the balls look nice so if you don't want to add all that bulk in with putting the strings through then this is a really good way to to do that i'm just putting a healthy amount of glue in and then just dropping that in and that will keep it in place my glue does dry clear so i know that we are all good there okay so i'm just going to do the last one and the same again i love that border with all the the alphabets on i think that's quite cool right so there you have it there's our first two cards for today okay so on to the next one um oh do you know what i quite like that on there but i'm thinking maybe no i like it on that one but you can't really see so i'm wondering if we if we were to sort of extend that a bit Or, you know just yeah I'm gonna do that so I'm gonna just pop some glue down the center of this tag like that turn it over and I'm just going to trim across the top of it on that side bit okay then yeah that's much better because this is going to be the topper for my next card Okay, so then that can go on there yeah I really like that so now that I've done that let's grab a card base and I'm going to grab one of these I'm going to just stick the whole sheet down like this there should be a little tiny border and there is okay then we've got this which i am going to put across the center we have it so we may as well use it so just like that and then i'm liking that but what i'm also going to do is bring in this green one behind just so that it just pops just a little bit more but i do want to decorate it up so i am going to add some of the stickers on so just that and then we've got these ones just so that it stands out just a little bit more and then like we did with the previous cards I'm going to grab the twine so I think we have to get the new roll now um, and just put a bow up there just for that oh actually no I'm not I'm going to pop pom in it there we go now I feel like we could maybe have something something else yeah it's just missing it was just missing that little something there we go so that is a card number three okay so let's get on to the last two cards and let's see what we have left now I've got two full sheets of paper left so let's use them 
Okay. So get that stuck down. And then let's do the same with this one. Okay. Like that. Now, I do have some of this which I really want to go onto this one. So let's stick that on. Uh, what have I dropped? Oh, the lid off my glue. I must remember I've dropped that, otherwise my glue will get, um, what you call it, blocked up. And then for this one, I'm thinking of having maybe, yeah, I'm going to use the tags again, I think, on this one. Um, I'm going to use that bloom and grow under there so what I want to do is I just want to decorate these two tags up so maybe like that yeah I think that'll work so let's do that I think there's one and there's the second one and then I'm going to glue these down onto my card base itself that's the first one and our second one and then this is going to go there and I am going to pop it up on some form I'm just going to put some glue down first just because uh, these are not great because all of that back and paper is just it's coming off as we're going Just like this. At least the back and paper comes off easy. But that is one bonus. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Sorry guys. It's a bit of a a bit of a nightmare. Okay. So next to us, uh, kids are out the side. We are in the school holidays, so it's only to be expected, but we're nearly finished. So let's get rid of all of this. Do you know what? Right, and then let's put plenty of glue on the top of these, like that. And then I'm gonna stick that down there. So it's a little bit different, isn't it? To, what we would normally do um, now instead of doing anything over the holes I'm actually just going to get the the sticker plants and we're going to use those to go over the holes just like that and then this one which can just go there just for our embellishments. So there we have it. That is card number four. And then on to our final one. Again, I think we can keep this pretty like. Right, I'm liking that. Yeah, okay, let's do that. So it is upside down because I don't want it as a tag. Okay, there we go, and then help if that was straight. Oh, and then I'm gonna glue this bit down here. Oh, I like that, I really like that. And then what else? One more. I'm going to use this sticker oh, if I can get it off which says oh no uh, it, it, they're not coming off right yeah these don't want to come off oh there we go 
So I'm going to put you grow girl. And then that's just going to go up at the top just like that. So there's that. And then I've got a couple of pom poms, but I think I'm going to leave them because I'm really happy actually with how that looks. I don't think I want to sort of add anything else, so I'm not going to. Right, let me show you what we have left. And then I will show you all the cards, including from the last video as well. So we've still got some sticker sentiments. They'll go in, um, I'll put them in one of the paper pads so we use them with them. We've got a couple of ephemera pieces. So we do have those. Actually, you know what, I've just thought those hearts could go on there. Yeah, I'm going to stick those hats on there. Um, we've got a little tag. I have two tags left from the tag kit. Um, some more sentiments, more bits of ephemera. Uh, we've got the f one full roll of the twine and another piece of ephemera. So all of these I will pop. Um, oh, and the washi tape. I will pop with the paper pad. Um, and we'll use them in the how many cards when I get round to, to doing that how many cards. So let's get me, let's get rid of this rubbish. There we go. What rubbish? What are you talking about? Um, so here are the cards that we have made in today's video. So we have these five here. Okay. Which I think look really, really nice. I love it when a kit goes together because it makes making cards really easily. And then these are the cards that we created in our first video. So lots of, oh, that's fell off. Oh, there's loads that fell off. Oh, that's no good, is it? Right, okay, so maybe they're no good for putting on the cards. Anyway, so lots of um, inspiration here, hopefully for you guys. But I'm loving them. I think they've turned out beautifully. I will be back again with another video very soon. But until then, please do all take care and happy crafting. Also, let me know what you think. Which one's your favourite? My favourite? Oh, oh, probably either this one or the very last one we did, that one. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.